Hello everyone, welcome, 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 I'm Ice Gumbers, and today we are back in Golden Sun. Come in. I don't... don't say that. Don't say that, Obama. No. That. I'm gonna spritz you with the water bottle. Welcome, Mr. Midnight. I hope you're good. <laughs> oh my gosh. We are planning on finally beating Golden Sun today. So I hope we party is racist. It's gonna be one of those nights, ain't it? <laughs> how y'all doing today? I don't want to know why. How, how? How is it racist? I'm scared to. Wa I'm scared to know now. Ah. <laughs> uh, anyway. Welcome, Jaden Morris. Welcome, Obama. Cross multiple big ones off the wish list of what's rising. Oh, nice! Any any particular standout ones? Alright, that's been lit. Playing Globetrotters and got a shopping trip. Alright. Easy enough. Let's do this finally. Welcome, Miss Tina. I hope you will. I'm trying to remember where exactly we, we, we left off here. And I'm a little bit, little bit worried. The Alpha Mode P3, the All Unions Type D, the Maserati 8CT. Whoa, a lot of classic ones. Beautiful cars. Accepted security. <laughs> oh. You didn't accept him, though. You, you, you like, le you freaking. I oh, know, I think Siguru had all of his papers in order, I think. First hotspot is in Canada, you go by maple syrup. <laughs> I mean, maple syrup is just delicious. Doing the right. Oh, yeah. Alright, we got a doodle bug. Easy. Alright, let's see. I think I need to go up through one of these towers. Oh! I can't do anything here. They lose every day 20. Oh, because they attack! Yeah, that, that part. I remember playing that and. It's difficult. It is so difficult. You gotta get it like exactly right. Good hot spot is Brazil. You gotta buy coffee beans. <laughs> On your. All right. So not that way. So what way is it? Is it this way? Look for a room filled with lava. I think I teleport here? I think I teleport here to get to like the dragons and stuff like that. The second spot is Mexico and you gotta buy a sombrero. <laughs> Bruh! Alright, that is, that is pretty bad. Welcome, Adachi! Actually, this should be the final or semi-final stream. We should be actually be fairly close to being done. Americans are racing a sombrero. Is there... Okay, but when you go to when you go to Mexico and only buy a sombrero for like your shopping trip, like that, that's a little bit racist. <laughs> Adam's really yep. You did, you, we did the Mr. Strike. I don't feel so good. Oh, this one. Okay, this one is lava. That 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 that's just that's just how Golden Sun works. You hold the star. That's different. Though. That that's that's like a costume. 
When you unlock a, like a worldwide shopping trip or whatever in Wii Party, but the only thing you buy is a sombrero in Mexico, like that, that, that that's a little, that's a little silly. <laughs> I can get a finish. Yeah. All right. Good. If you wish to scale the heavens, set the four spirits of flame. Okay, but uh, to be honest. I love Speedy. Speedy is absolutely amazing. I have not played Wii Party. Sounds like fun though. Fish. With cold courage they rule the water. Okay. So... Go to Britain just to drink a Guinness? <laughs> Based! Oh, I thought it was drink Guinness. I mean, that's not too, too far from the truth, though. <laughs> Do I parch? All right, that one, that one I'm a little bit confused. Dragons. Burning with might, they rule the fires. All right, we can at least light this one, I think. This one, I think, is Blaze. It's just an invisible door. When I complete GTA San Andreas, they need to do... I'm probably after beat San Andreas, I might do a replay of Midnight Club 1, but do it as like a challenge stream. I think that's gonna be fun. Whoa, 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 what? Oh! Okay. This is interesting. But I do intend to eventually play all the GTA games, even the, uh, the stories games as well. Ah, fries and chips and chips to crisps. <laughs> Different languages, it's fun. What do they call biscuits? So biscuits are almost like crackers to them, and like, regular American biscuits are like... Um... Like bread, or like dinner rolls. I think there's something. No, there's nothing around here. But we can bonk it. Aka mana, aka gone. There we go. That was easy. Ooh boy. All right, so we have in here a bunch of ice. Oh. Interesting. Whoa, okay, so we can't go that way. Gotcha. We can go down. Go right, up, left, up. There we go. In through here. Perfect. That can go there. Oh. Whoa. This is new. I mean, that's usually I kind of stay in my own lane for that stuff. But I'm not too, too keen on drama of any, of any kind, really. I have no enemies. I just vibe. So what do I do here? So this is obviously a room. Great, great, great thought, Isaac. This is a room. I think... 
I need to freeze this. Maybe. There we go, a little bit closer. Biscuits or cookies, okay. Gotcha. All right, so that one is there. Now, how do I get to that one? I can't get through here. Unless I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm very dumb. Okay. I see. I see. Okay. Alright. Huh. Oh, I gotcha. I I see I see the the issue. Scones are biscuits. Hmm. Oh, scones are not biscuits. Scones are scones are delicious though. Oh my gosh. I love scones. No, no, I think I need the fire because the fire the fire is what will um. The fire is what will uh, allow me to ignite the dragon. I need to ignite the dragon, but I need to use ice to turn on the fire. Ice, I see what I need to do now. There we go. That's lit. That's lit. The 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 sconce. Alright, now... Oh gosh. There we go, make it all! <laughs> oh, he's just getting the meteor. He's just getting the meteor to the face. Alright, good. No curse. Don't need to worry about that at all. Boom, Megiro. <laughs> nice. All right. Try a finger. <laughs> ah, yes. The um. Oh, what? Which? What is that from? That's from. Elden Ring, right? Elden Ring or Dark Souls Three? One of those two. All right, I need to do a boop, 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 and I need to go this side. And this should ignite the gas. So, boom. Preferably when it's closer. There we go, now it's ignit. There we go. Alright, and I wanna go boop. Boop. Boop, boop, and then boop. There we go. Yes. All right, so we're through there. And this, this is, this is fish tower. I'm a little confused. Uh, 
what do I do here? Okay, supply isn't working. Frost? It's, it's, it's the mercury one, because it's a fish. It's the water one. So... Um... Blaze? I might I might try Blaze, but that's that's strange that it's it's a Mercury Flame. Never mind, it's Blaze. D -d -d Despite Mercury being the water element, you still need to use Blaze. Yo, Bin Laden got a limit last week. What? <laughs> Uh, I I don't know the context. <laughs> All right, so that one's been sorted. So the fish, the fish has been lit, fam. Uh, now the dragon, I think. I imagine that one also has a uh, thingy. Megiro! Yes! Boom shakalaka! All right, let's let's go let's go the dragon way. Last week I said I was ready. Oh, that Bin Laden! I'm like, I thought Bin Laden was like twenty. Ten or some 2010, 2011. <laughs> you know, still Team Six. The other, the other Bin Laden. Okay. <laughs> I. No, that makes sense. That I get it now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, Obama got the other Bin Laden. <laughs> uh. All right, let's go to the Dragon Tower now. Let's let's see what craziness. Watch, this one's gonna need water. This one's gonna need douse in order to make the flame go flamey. Ow. Megiro! Boom shakalaka! There we go. We've leveled up so much to take down Dolohan that, like, we're just unstoppable now. This actually has a really good song with gorillas. <laughs> what? This is just chaotic. Alastair's hood. Ooh. Alastair's hood. Used to haunt a foe? <laughs> that is cool. We can, we can haunt a foe. Based. Alright, blow up the door. Sweet. Alright, let's blow up this one as well. Boom shakalaka. Oh, they did not like us blowing up their doors.
that is okay. Because we are uh, taking them out anyway. Bye bye. All right. I think I want to do the left side. I might want to do the left side. I think the left side is the better one. It's pointed that Gorilla's Clint Eastwood had nothing to do with Clint Eastwood at first. Oh, for real. I'm, I was kind of sad about that too. Like, okay, but why call it Clint Eastwood? Alright, that's been turned on. Alright, so that's... that's at least started. Alright, now I can go into the right side. And I can probably ignite it. Ooh. Or I can get it to... ooh! Ooh, two free birds! I mean, fire birds. Same thing. Come on, so someone's got to play the Freebird solo. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Get purgatoried. Sweet. I want to go left. Never mind, I want to go... And I haven't played this dungeon in a really long time. I <laughs> any of this. Don't worry. I don't know any of this either. Oh, I gotta go all the way down here to jump all the way up. There we go. Alright, Mia, do your thing. I like how Mia is like one of the most destructive ones of the group. <laughs> Just an absolute menace. Little little menacing bean. She's like, oh, I can learn all the destructive fire spells and everything. Well that's part for the chorus of Mia, let's be real. Freebird solo goes perfectly with Don Fry's fight with Rishiro Takimura. Nice. It also goes perfectly with pretty much any big one survival. Like any 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 time you survive the big one in any like sim race ever, you're like, just just play that as you're working your way through the traffic and just taking all the avoiding action. It just works. Oh, we got the 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 Akamana. Akamana's no mana. Alright, well that one can go straight up. Ah. Uh, okay. And I need to move you. There. There. Oh. I, I see. I see. I see. The Devil Z was American, the free but scrubby its theme. Oh my gosh. Just the the the, the biggest The biggest Alas V8 with the massive supercharger just sticking on the top would be like the most American Devil Z. <laughs> Alright, so I need to head back. So I need to go in here, and I need to... I need to do this. Okay, so I do actually need to do that then. The devil vets. <laughs> LS, put, a, put an LS9 in a, like a Z3 vet. 
that that is, that is creating the devil vets. Oh, okay. I just need to go. I need to. Okay, okay. There's multiple ways to go through that. And I just need to block off the one fire. Okay. So this makes sense. So I move you one over. And then I go back the other way and I can get another one. Bro, these Minotaurs. Thankfully, they're really quick to beat. Oop. Let's go up through here, move you one more over. There we go, that, that's that pathway blocked. What color would it be though? Um, probably like a deep, like metallic red. Like almost like a pearl red. Like a pearl, pearl, pearl maroon. That would be. Hmm. That that would legit be sick. Boom! Titan Blade. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Donka Shonka. Ow. All right, we need to, we need to take out the. Say no more. Oh, are you are you actually creating it? Oh, that is so cool. If you are. All right, so now I can push this out of the way. And this lets me go back through again. Somewhere. Okay, yes. So this now lets me reach the the other way that was blocked here. Alright, heal our party ailments and everyone else bonk it. It's gonna die anyway, but you know. <laughs> and now what? I can go through here. And this should actually let me go through the exit. Alright, Mia, do your thing. Yes! Alright, Fire Dragon is done. That's two. That is two now. All right. Now we can go back through here, back to the entrance. So these are these two done. Oh. Uh... Alright, I can't move that. So... Um... How do I get back? Oh gosh, how do I get <laughs> I managed to get through it. How do I get it? How do I get it back? Alright, ow, that hurt a little bit. But at least we don't have the evil spirits. And we gotta level up. Do you wanna get into there? The only way to do that is through that side. Do I have to use retreat? Please don't take me to the beginning. Please don't take me to the beginning. Oh. 
Oh, you. Okay, please tell me they're at least both lit. This Golden Sun series started eight months ago. Holy cow. That's been a long, okay, that has been a long, long time. Is that, that, that's, that's probably like both games, right? I mean, it's been a fun, it's been a fun journey though, going through both of them. Okay, good, they are both lit. All right, next up, human, I think. And it's all gonna come to an end tonight, I think, I hope. Yeah, both games. I mean, that's not too, too bad for a playthrough of like two major, you know, RPGs and all that stuff. I've been having a blast with them too. Oh? Ow! Okay. Thank, thanks game for that one. Ow! Is this one gonna also hurt me? No, th this this is the right one. This is the right one. I see. I see. All right. There's a lot of them. I'm gonna go into this one. Watch it, watch it be a trap. Like, all of them are traps. And only the right one is, like, the actual right one. That would be hilarious. That would be, that would be great. Okay. So that's not... Oh, I gotta go a different way then. Okay. This is gonna be a fun one. Oh, you f- Alright. No, that one has it. So I notice you can see the wolf head if you start to move it. Or the dragon head, what have you. So that one had it, because you kind of see its ears sticking out just a little bit. Alright, you see that one, that one has it. And you see how they disappear. This one doesn't, so this one is the door. Okay, so that's how you know. This one's an interesting one. Alright, so let's get you over here. And how do I want to do this? Oh, okay. And each of these are only one square high. I was thinking about how to like stack two on top of each other. This one? Does she have carry? She has carry. There we go. Yes. Yes! Okay, we, we be extra smart. We be 120% smart here. 
Giga Brain, Giga IQ Isaac. Alright, now on to the rope. Alright. So now that's that is out of the way. So what do we do here? All right, there's something here. Is this like a pressure plate? What is that? Alright, it's not something I can really like, interact with, interact with. But obviously it's something, because you use you can see there's another one over there. And there weren't they weren't the ones here. Is that like Done. Ooh, all right. I want to. I want to see pictures of that. Whenever you get the synergy, if you haven't played any transfer pass of the first game, that's a good question. They they may give like Isaac and company like the base synergies needed uh, to do to do the 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 thing. But otherwise, we'll probably leave them at like exactly your level with like bare minimum coin and all that stuff. Is that sand, maybe? It is! Oh my gosh! Okay. Okay, it's sand. I'm like, it's something. Use it somehow to, like, stop the, the fire. It's sand. Ah, hmm. <laughs> okay. That... That actually makes sense. That actually makes sense. It's just green sand. <laughs> That's a fun thing as well. Is like this game, it doesn't it doesn't really tell you much, which is a double edged sword. On the one hand, it makes you feel really really smart when you figure it out, but on the other hand, you're stuck figuring out and being like, oh. The opposite of the Devil Z, which has unimpressive power but very lightweight. Devil Vent is not very light but has overwhelming power. <laughs> Bez. Best Vent. I, 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 I want to see pictures of this beast. Yes, Megiro! Thank you, thank you, give me the Purgaturger. Sweet. Alright, I put it. Ooh, okay. Hang on a sec. I am gonna take a look at the Discord. <laughs> Based. That is good stuff. Alright, so that's three of four. Now, just make sure we save our quest. We got one more to go. 
And this is going to be the air. Is that the supercharged LS engine? Yes. That is awesome. Mega power. Honestly, the music in this game is, is quite good. Oh, I see. I remember this. The These we use, what, Whirlwind one, I think? I'm gonna go this way. One of these ways is the right way. Oh gosh, there's two of them. They got the they got the scythes. <laughs> Alright, at least that one's asleep. Which is good because, ow. This should finish them off. There we go. Nice. That's good. They're both, they're both slayers. Wrong one. Cyclone. Oh my gosh, alright, this this one's actually a big one. Eh? Oh, this is the exit! We win in the exit! <laughs> oh, pain, Pecco. That is, that is a pain, Pecco moment. There we go, that one's down. Alright. Finish you off, Mr. Bully. <laughs> A little bit of overkill. Hey <laughs> yo! Oh no. Oh gosh. Oh Uh, you, you, you know the saying, the chat matches the streamer? Uh... That, 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 that may be true. That may be true. The, the chat does match the streamer sometimes. <laughs> Alright, let's go, let's go with the, 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 the... Which one do we want to use? I'm going right again. It can't be left two times in a row, right? It was left twice in a row. It was left twice in a row. I... <laughs> it was left twice. We 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 wrong hold. All right, time time to do the walk back of shame. This is quick. I thought you were gonna take. 
I don't know, at this point we keep choosing the wrong hole. So... May, well, I, th this one might take a bit longer. I love the vet. It's both fast and straight and because of the tweaking the suspension. Ah, oh, nice! You got you got the mega... The mega devil vet. Ah, oh, that is cool. I saw, I saw the picture. That's good stuff. Okay. So left left is best. That is that is what we have learned. Is that left is best. Alright, let's, let's go let's go let's go through the right the, the cor not the right, the correct side. The right is the wrong side. Left is the correct side. Uh, and we gotta go back anyway! Oh, Bruh! That ain't right. <laughs> that ain't right. Oh, man. Alright. You know what? Move a canyon right in the sunlight. Not as deep as I thought it was. It's going for one. I mean, it is still a nice colored vet, though. Very, very pretty. I love the wheels on it as well. Oh my gosh, I can't believe... I can't believe it. Alright, now we go to the right side, and hopefully we don't have to constantly backtrack this much. <laughs> Because, my word, poor, 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 poor Shiba's like, alright, which side now, guys? Oh, man. Wee. Ah, just like Error's Rock, the wind, the wind one is, is the most difficult one, and the longest one. Boom. And now we don't have the fire block uh, hurting us. Alright, so what do we do here? We go around. Alright, we got a reveal here. Alright, that'll lead us through here. We can tell- we can, uh... Whirl a cyclone through here. Go back up. And this will put us on the other side. That hopefully will allow us to block off the fire. I think. There we go. Okay. Take that, ow. And now, now we can not get hit with the fire. All right, and we can hover. There we go. There we go. mothers I wasn't ready <laughs> uh, just out of curiosity Jaden for the vet how much power is that making like I know, I know you said I made like a crazy amount of power but roughly like how much we have exact numbers probably in like the 800s 900s somewhere in that range yeah, you know, some crazy amount like hypercar level power.
There we go, that's down. <sighs> Fix it, more of a cinnamon red. 1014! Alright, that is some, that is some nice power. That is some respectable power. Okay. So we gotta be extra quick on this one. I got a side crystal. All right, nothing there. Okay. Oh gosh. Wow. <laughs> okay, me uh Jenna, do your thing. Jenna mena 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 mena. Jenna mena mena mena. And I ain't going through that again. Nope. Retreat. I know how to get to the dragon anyway. Honestly, it's it's quicker this way. <laughs> it's quicker this way. Travel instead of a blackbird, the dark horse Mustang, yes. Maybe a Ooh. I mean, I either either Mustang Cobras would work. Either the Fox Body Mustang Cobra, or the the um the most recent must the the, the you know the SN95 slash New Age Mustang Cobra would be good. All right, here we go. You have proven your worth. The heavens await you. Oh! All right. This is where it goes down. I'm gonna need this luck. <laughs> okay. I'm scared. I'm nervous. But we got this. Womp, womp, womp. Betrayers, you have arrived. Who said that? The wind's too strong. I can't see anything. I heard it too, but I don't see anyone else up here. Felix, quick, cast the Mars story before anything has a chance to stop us. So, you are still intent on laying the beacon of Mars Lighthouse? Who said that? Have you forgotten me so soon, Isaac? And you, Garrett? It seems to know you, Isaac. Do you have any idea what it is? And search your heart, boy! Ah, voice! Oh, it's the wise one! The eyeball dude! It's the wise one! Isaac, since when are you on a first name basis with the wise one? <laughs> well, you see, Crane and I got a life outside adventuring, and the wise one and I, we used to be homies, but then we had a falling out, you know, you see? It just, 
it just didn't work out, you know. He 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 he's he's a chilling, relaxed at home kind of vibing guy, and I'm a out and exploring and you know hitting up the club kind of dude, you know. It it just didn't work out. It must have been Isaac. What happened in Soul Sanctum after we were kidnapped? Uh, when Saturusim and Artie stole the elemental stars, they also triggered a volcanic eruption. And the wise one prevented Mount Ella from erupting so that Garrett and I could escape. But, wait. The Mount Aleph did erupt. And there was a huge explosion. We saw it all the way in Vault. But it would have erupted with us still inside. There was no way we would have escaped in time. The wise one held off the eruption until we could escape. He even halted the lava flow. I can't believe it. Nobody has enough power to do that. I know it sounds weird, but I was there, and it happened, so you'll just have to believe us. If they can do all that, this wise one seems more like a god than an adept. I did not just save you. I also tasked you with recovering the four elemental stars. Why have you disobeyed my commands? Why have you come to light the beacon? Because Prox would be destroyed if we don't. We can't let that happen. Prox? They have brought this disaster upon themselves. Source, trust me, bro. My source is that I made it up. I, uh, are you saying we should just abandon them to die? What do they do to deserve that? The people of Prox have committed an unforgivable sin. They must pay the price. And that sin being? Living too far north, apparently? For lighting the lighthouses? Is that their sin? That's probably a more reasonable sin, actually, lighting the lighthouses. Does that warrant total destruction? If we don't light the beacon, Gaia Falls will eventually erode away all of Weyard. We have fought for so long to save all the people of our world, and now you would stop us? Gaia Falls is growing. It's consuming more and more with each passing day. How can you just allow the world to crumble into nothingness? The seal needs to be broken. The world will be destroyed if it's not. You have learned to... So creating an abate so ships don't get lost is a sin. <laughs> uh, the other nav... I mean, the lighthouses basically restore alchemy. So yeah, they kind of are quote-unquote lighthouses, but this, this is different lighthouses. You have learned far too much. Wise one! It can't continue to protect the lighthouses. You know what's happening. It is your duty to protect all of Weird. If Weird is destroyed, you will have failed us all. Why won't you answer us, wise one? If alchemy is unleashed, mankind may well destroy all of Weird itself. But we can combine our strengths. Ensure that alchemy is not be used for evil. It is inevitable. In time, one man will seek to rule over all. It is human nature. Inescapable. And it shall come sooner than any of you think. Why do you say that? The water adapt who climbs toward the peak of Mount Aleph, even as we speak. Interrupts the wise one and drops a meteor on a magic style. <laughs> if only we had enough gin ready for that. Just drop the meteor on him like a boss. Is he not a friend of yours? Alex is his name. Surely you have not forgotten him. Alex? What would he be doing on Mount Aleph? Uh, probably trying to go for the Mara Star. He understands far more than you do. He knows that when the four beacons have been lit, their light will gather at Soul Sanctum. 
How long would he came from being there? When the final beam of light reaches the peak of Mount Aleph, the golden sun shall rise. Roll credits! Ding! <laughs> The golden sun? What is that? And what would Alex want with it? When the four beams merge into one, they form a golden light bathing Mount Aleph's peak. How did he get there so fast? We had to cross the ocean. Magic and the plot. Is, is that alchemy? I mean, pure alchemy made real, at the heart of its power. Was that a cinema sense reference? Maybe just a little bit. <laughs> and it's that light that gives shape to the Stone of Sages. This has been Alex's one true desire from the very start. Alex planned all this? Then he must have been after this power all along. We've been duped! He used us all! Oh, you better believe he's not getting away with this! Alex, how could he do this? He's... he's one of my own people. I feel sick. Disgusted. None of that matters right now. We still have to light the beacon. We don't have any choice. If we don't do it now, Prox will be destroyed. Felix, we have to, right? Uh, can we remove Alex first? Like, like all the preparation is in place. We, we might be better off taking care of Alex first. Because there's eight of us and one of him. And we got two fire add-ups that can, like, you know, smoke his ass. One of your people. No, no, no. A Alex, Alex is from the same tribe as, uh... Alex is from the same tribe as Mia. Alex, I think, is like her brother? He's the blue-haired evil dude. She bet we do. The wise ones have to deal with Alex on his own. I cannot, I cannot interfere in the actions of mankind. If you can't interfere, then how are you about getting out of her way so we can light the beacon, huh? Damn, Jenna! She got sass on her. Ooh. <laughs> Literally everyone looked and was like that one, um, that one vine with all the guys going, Oh! <laughs> that was literally like Jenna's bra moment right there. Oh, good one, Jenna. I don't like doing exactly what Alex wants, but it's looking like we've got no choice. Don't worry, Felix. Just throw the Mars Star into the beacon. Now. Oh, throw the... Uh, bleh, bleh, bleh. Just throw the Mars Star into the beacon as well, now. Wise one. Didn't you just say that you aren't allowed to interfere with her actions? That is correct. I cannot stop you. But, what if some miracle were to occur? One that prevented you from igniting the beacon. Ooh, wise ones being sneaky with the rules. Miracle? What are you talking about? What kind of miracle? If you can defeat a miracle, only then can you ignite the beacon's flame. The wise one is up to something. You worry, everyone. We don't know what it's capable of. What is that? What is that? No, seriously, what is that? Oh. A three headed dragon? That's your miracle? So you would have us fight for our future. Fine, then fight we shall. What's he thinking? <coughs> we already beat a two-headed dragon. How much tougher can this one be? 
I don't care how many heads it has. Nothing's gonna stop us now. That doesn't look any miracle I've ever seen before. It looks like a tragedy. And let's do it. For Brox, for the future of Wayard. Oh, wait a second. Wasn't that two-headed dragon actually... So that means this three-headed dragon must be... Felix! No! You mustn't fight that dragon. It's... It's too late, Creighton. We can't get away from it now. Felix! Don't! Stop! <laughs> Doom Dragon appeared. Alright, let's boost defense. All right, what should we do now? May as well do a uh, double attack. Felix, no, that dragon is literally gone. <laughs> yeah, it's probably something. All of Isaac's gen Oh, it's doing the gin thing as well. That's annoying. Okay. Okay. So all of Isaacs has been drained. So let's switch you with Jenna then. And just hope for the best. Alright, speed up gin recovery time. Um, may as well see if we can't stun it. It's booster attack. Jenna is forever the sa- yes! Jenna is ex extra sassy. Like, Garrett is hot heaven, but Jenna is just like that, that, that sassy little fireball. Alright, decent amount of damage. Oh, it can still Gin Blast though, okay. So that's annoying. Wow, alright. Um, I guess Shade? Alright, all of his are on standby, so we're gonna switch you out with Piers and try to get something in. Let's go with Shade. It usually drains the gins if you. Oh. So because we blocked the synergy, it drained the gin. Okay. That's annoying. Let's bolster our defense as well. Hopefully, hopefully, we'll stop doing that now. So we can at least get some summons in, because right now we're doing pitiful damage. It's not n immediately like one-shotting us like Dullahan. But it it's definitely getting a little bit spicy. Okay, that's not too, too much. Okay, so this is good.
All right, let's get Boreas in here. Let's get full heals. Mm. Let's increase her attack. And we can also summon Judgment too. And there we go. This should be good. This should be good. This will help us out a lot. Hopefully. Only 582. Okay. That's not a lot. Oh, man. All right, come on, Ice Maker. All right, 835. So it's got a heavy defense. But it doesn't do a whole lot of damage. All right, let's switch you with Garrett. Get you in. Let's see if we can't lower its defense. Let's see if we can't paralyze it. And let's get meteor on it. May as well try to get as much done as possible. Alright, yeah, it's, it's, it's a very low amount of damage. So it's basically just us kind of wailing away on it. Alright, Blast Breath is a little bit tricky. It's tonic. Alright, let's switch you out for Felix. Let us tonic. Let's summon Boreas again. May as well. And let's get some heals in. Alright, it's got Delusion. That might at least help it prevent it from doing any melee attacks. It only casts stuff now. Probably. Okay, good. That didn't do too, too much. Oh, Piers. Oh, Piers, hang in there, buddy. Okay. All right, let's switch you with Isaac. I'm gonna give you heals. Gonna reduce your defense some more. Increase our defense. Actually, we may as well... Oh, we don't have... That's fine. We're going to hold it in place for a time. Uh, no, no. We want... We want defense first. And we can hold it in place that way. There we go. Boom. Okay, so now it's only two now it's only two heads. So one head's down. So we're like a third of the way through, I think. Alright, 
let's use you. Let's reduce your resistance. And then we're gonna take it a little bit more heals. Nice. Ooh, less nice. Pierce, hang in there, buddy. Oh gosh, Pierce. Pierce. Okay, we're gonna do that. We're gonna do that. I'm gonna summon. No. We're going to. Hold you in place. And then we're gonna summon judgment this way. There we go. Alright, now let's switch to the two Jupiter Jin. Uh, you. Two Jupiter users. Hit the Wii party. There's a baby mini game. What does the baby mini game do? What do you do in the baby mini game? Okay, there we go. Alright, it's just focusing on Earth right now. Heavy Earth. Alright, so let's switch you with Sheba. Create a shield. Let's summon the ice machine. Um, let's see if we can't poison it. You have to lift your Wiimote up and down in rhythm with a beating heart. Oh. So yeah, that that, that might that might be tricky. That, that, that might legitimately, maybe legitimately be tricky then. Because imagine, like, if, like, the speaker's not great or whatever, it's, you know, if it doesn't fully detect it, trying to get it to, you know, in, in rhythm is going to be real tricky. Especially with aging, um, aging hardware, too. Welcome, Antivirus. Hope you're well. Thousand and two damage. Okay, so that's a little bit of damage. Oh, what is cruel ruin? Oh boy, this this is when Nintendo got their uh, World of Light idea from, guys. <laughs> Okay. We're gonna switch you. Let's get Ivan in here as well. Let's get you healed up. Let's weaken your attack some more. Let's see if we can't calm you. And let's boost our resistance. And hopefully we can get some good summons in. All right, good, no effect on Shiba. Didn't paralyze her. Oh, Mia, hang in there, Mia. <laughs> Mia is an absolute trooper right now. Okay. All right, let's increase elemental strength. This tail fog. I could summon Eclipse. Eclipse may be the way to go. Eclipse is probably the way to go. I 
Alright, let's paralyze you. Alright, let's breath Mia. Let's get Mia just a little bit more healed. Okay. That's 12 damage. That's not good. Okay, so we need to break its we need to break its aura. Hopefully this does some good damage still. Even with the protective barrier. 82 damage. Okay, that ain't good. That is that is a very bad that is a very uh unfortunate. Unfortunate circumstance. Speed up gen recovery time. So reduces defense. Let's see if we can't paralyze it or at least partially. Uh low Luff won't do much. Okay, it's it's starting to get a little bit less. Uh, so only it's only for that turn. Okay, so we at least just we only really wasted a, a summon. That's not too too bad actually. There we go. There we go. There we go. Ow. Okay. Little bit difficult. Yeah, let's go shade, let's go defense here. Alright, let's store you. Let's summon Eclipse. And let's boost her resistance as well. That should help out a lot with reducing damage even more. And this should probably take out the next head, I think. Should be enough to take out the next head. Alright. One head left. Alright, let's heal you. Heal the party. Let's have her hide away. And let's boost her resistance. There we go. And this should help her avoid the damage and everything, because she's really close to going down. Let's see if we can do this without anyone going down at all. He isn't able to move. That's not great. It's not bad. We managed to survive that. Right, let's fizz you. Let's see if we can't put that to sleep. Summon Eclipse. And let's boost our agility. Oh no! Okay, that's bad timing. This is using the guard aura, so Eclipse isn't gonna do much. Dang. 115 damage. At least his attack's going down, it's not attacking as much. But it is going to use Cruel Ruin. Okay. That's... That's not good. We got Ward Elated. Alright, let's go... Oh, wait, hang on. 
Let's switch you out. Okay, let's get Garrett in. Let's go Tonic. Let's go Synergy there. Boost part of defense. And let's give that to Jenna. There we go. All right, now we can switch out with Jenna. I'm sorry, yeah, we can switch out with Jenna. Another cruel ruin. All right, Mia's going down then. Damn, all right. That's a little bit annoying. Let's get Jenna in. Get you. Let's boost the party defense. Divide Jenna. Hooker thought he would get out of this without fighting. <laughs> nah. All of them are fighting. All of them. All of them are fighting. I'm making sure all of them have a, a hand in the battle. Tinder in game doing the exact opposite of Tinder in real life. Making people not dead. I can! Okay. Why? Why is he using Crew Ruin so much when it only has one head? I, 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 like, I'm just, I'm just curious why. <laughs> like, it literally every time it's like, all right, we're going to use Cruel Ruin. I'm glad we're going, like, hyper defensive with this. Because otherwise, like, that, that, that's got to be ridiculous. All right, come on, Garrett, mess it up. 811, that's not bad. Maybe because it's dying. I mean, yeah, that, that kind of makes sense, but still. Like, yeah, I know it's dying, but like, bruh, can, can you not kill us while we're also dying? Alright, let's boost our attack even more. That way, Judgment, Judgment might take it down. I need four water for ire. Oh my gosh. Okay, that one's gonna be a tricky one. Spruce of defense. And let's just do another attack. Brah! <laughs> We're gonna waste all our summons here.
That's sad. At least did a nice amount of damage. It did, it did a nice amount of damage. It did 69 damage. <laughs> and then cool ruin. Mmm. This is gonna mess us up, ain't it? Yep. Yeah, it is. You do that. And potion. Cool. That's perfect. <laughs> I'm sorry, Felix. Let's see if this does something. All right, good. No effect on peers, at least. Bro, stop using Kuruin. <laughs> I was gonna go full, like, attack mode. Yep, alright, cool. Now let's get Mia up. Booster resistance. And we can at least increase her attack, and hopefully this works. Why is it taking so long to die? Um, because it keeps defending right when we have our summons ready. And so our summons aren't doing a whole lot of damage. Bruh! Bruh. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. We got through the first two parts perfectly fine. And I was like, alright, I'm gonna use Cruel Ruin. Alright, I'm gonna use Cruel Ruin. I'm gonna use Cruel Ruin. Ah. Uh.
I <laughs> Oh my gosh. Like this is this is kind of crazy. This is kind of ridiculous. One, two, three, four, five. YOLO. And then just for extra fun. Now that's four. There is four. All right. All right. It wants to play hardball. It want it wants to play hardball. So we're 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 gonna absolutely wreck and shrek this thing up because at this point. The, 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 that, that, that was, that was some bull. Yeah, 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 hi. Hi, you little, you little eyeball testicle. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's annoying that we have to go through the cutscene. Like, as cool as it was, we're acting it out and everything. We're gonna Shrek it. It shouldn't have come in our swamp. It shouldn't have come in our swamp. Okay. Hmm. Give me a drink of water. Ah, yeah, we have learned too much. We have learned that the Doom Dragon is a punk. I love the old RPG trope of putting, like, I mean, it's kind of funny, but, like, they put, like, the longest cutscene before, like, the toughest battles. So what would otherwise be a really, really cool, like, scene and heartfelt and touching and hypes you up now is annoying, like, the third or fourth time going through it, and you're like, bruh. Jenna! <laughs> if I make a save state. <laughs> nah. I mean, maybe. I may actually do that. Oh, there's a fast forward option. Whoops. Alright, I'll do that next time. We're gonna give everyone the 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 the, the cane of the coke. Okay. Gender recovery time. Let's go, Iris. Get absolutely shrecked. Okay, only Isaacs. That's not bad, actually. Okay. Alright. You wanna be a punk? Do you wanna be a punk? Because this is how we make it a punk. That is pretty, actually. Whoa. <laughs> Only 1804 damage? That's not a lot actually. That that that's that's I'm a little bit I'm a little bit disappointed. Uh 
Oh, but did heal us as well. So that that that's cool. All right, let's switch Isaac with Piers. Just, just in case, let's heal up Garrett. Because Garrett's going to be hurting as well in just a second. Let's drop your defense some. And let's bolster ours. This is going to be interesting. That's not bad, actually. Cool, no effect on Mia. Very low damage, let's keep it that way. A spray work in this game looks... Oh, welcome, Gabriel. Yeah, the sprite, the, the sprites in this game are actually really solid for a GBA game. Like, they do a really good job with this. Like, holy moly. It is, it is the good, the good stuff. We can summon Boreas in the time being as we try to get all the other ones knocked out. Boost our party attack as well. Okay. It's a little bit. That's almost a thousand. That doesn't do a whole lot of damage. I thought it was a PS1 game because of how some of the effects looked. Oh yeah, no, like the people, Cam Camelot did a really good job with this game. Like, holy moly. They did, they did some really, really good stuff. Alright. Let's boost our defense. weaken our attack even more. Let's see if we can't paralyze it. I mean, the, the gin itself is doing a decent amount of, uh, decent job. Dang. But that is... Got some heavy damage. Okay. I need Garrett to stay up for the time being. I'm gonna increase our elemental strength this time around. Last attack. Heals. Let's increase our- oh wait, no, no, hang on a second. I do want to increase elemental strength. I am going to potion. I'm gonna heals. And I'm gonna increase her attack even more, and I'm gonna do another powerful summon from Garrett.
Perfect, that's exactly what I wanted to wait for. Okay. Good. That's not bad, actually. That's not bad. Alright, party ailments. Ha. I could keep selling Ulysses. But I might be better off doing... Yeah, okay. Yeah, let's do this. Let's increase our speed even more. That's not a whole lot. But that's fine because we got ready for the next one. You can summon gods and a meteor. Yes. And a nuke from space. Right, let's get Boreas in here. Yeah, okay. I do I do want that. Okay, good. It's got delusion. That may help out actually. We got the ice maker summoned. Alright, me, me is a- oh gosh, not Cruel Ruin. Cruel Ruin will ruin us. Unironically. It just does so much damage. Alright, let's get Felix in here. Let's try to keep doing more damage to it. I mean, to go down so it could surely take a dragon out too. True. I'm gonna switch Garrett for Isaac. I'm gonna see if I can't slow it down some. Drop its attack. And let's revive you. Alright, so the damaging ones do a decent amount of damage. How much exactly? I'm not too sure. That's not too, too bad. Okay. Let's get Felix in here. Create a watery shield for the time being. Right, 
let's steal some hit points from it. Nice. There we go. Okay, Crew Ruin, that may take out Jenna, actually. Oh, the rest of them should be able to survive it. Okay, no, never mind. We're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. Alright, let's get Garrett in. Okay. Take your potion, buddy. Alright, now we're in it for the long haul. Now we're in it for the long haul. We're in it for the long haul. Let's do this. Mother fire trucker. That's all right. Because we are ready. Yep, yeah, that's all right. That's all right. We're good. I'm going to strike through your defense. I'm going to hold you for the time being. I'm going to slow you. I want to have you drink a potion. There we go. Alright, that's not too, too bad. That is a little bit bad, though. But I think we got the right idea. It doesn't seem to be doing a whole, whole lot of damage to us all that much. There we go, there's a little bit more damage to it. Alright, our resistances are normal. Our block damage. Teal up. And teal up just a little bit more. And let's boost our attack, and we should be able to take it out with the next summons. There we go, we're back in the right spot. Okay, that's a little bit annoying. We had the fence. We at least had the defense going. <sighs> okay. right, let's at least boost our agility. You suck. You suck, Doom Dragon. <laughs> And <laughs> it knows. It just knows I'm gonna go on a summon spree. Okay. That's fine. That's fine, because the damage doesn't carry over to the next one, I don't think. It's multiple stages. So we can, we can be all right. It's rapid and feverish delusion for the time being. Do I want it to be diluted though? No, I want defense. Let's go all out on the attacks. Oh, 
Alright, there's already almost a thousand. Alright, eleven hundred. And now defense. Alright, Garrett might go down, but we can revive him with Jenna. Alright. Intense. I kind of wish she had taken out Garrett. Because Garrett doesn't have a whole, whole lot he can do right now. <sighs> Screw it. It's already using Crew Ruin. Let's give that to you. Let's boost part of defense. Imagine not using a safe state. <laughs> I want to try to beat it as close to legitimately as possible. I, I, I do want to beat it as close to legitimately as possible. Alright, yeah, I know the curse. Cool, no effect. Crew Ruin might be a little bit trucky. We did increase our defense, so hopefully we survive this. We can block its energy now, so it won't do crew. Oh. You know, that's a good point. That is a good point. Let's give that to you. There we go. There we go. Okay. And now Daedalus. All right, 427, the nice engine. It's not too, too bad, actually. All right, let's torch it. Full attack. Yeah, full attack. Nice. Okay. That's fine. This thing should be closed to down. There's the missile. <laughs> yes! Oh, does it have a no head version? What? Way! No way! Is... Is that Felix's family? And Jenna's family? No! No way! H who are they? That's what I was trying to warn you about! 
wasn't just the dragon you killed. No. No. Uh, I remember you warning us, but it was too late for us to stop. Kraden, what do you know? Why were you trying to stop us from fighting the dragon? It was the wise one's final trap. The trap? What do you mean? Our wise ones knew he couldn't stop you. So he played a cruel, wretched trick on you instead. Kraden, uh, I don't understand. What are you trying to tell us? Uh, Shiba, let's see who these people are while they try to sort this out. No! Shut up! Don't look. You mustn't look. It will only bring you pain. Uh, what are you talking about, Kraden? Uh, they can't hurt us anymore. We'll just... <sighs> oh, no. What's the matter, Jenna? It, it can't be. How? How? Mm. Uh. What is it, Isaac? Uh. Mm. Oh, Isaac! I, I knew that guy! That's your dad! Then, does that mean the other two are... Uh... Uh... Mom? Dad? Oh, you your Jenna's parents! Quickly! Mia, send Isaac's father! If only, if only I'd realized sooner. Well, that was a downer. What, what's the matter, Piers? Why did you stop? Jenna's parents need you. Uh, don't give up, Mia. You can't. You have to save them. It's... It's no use, Ivan. I'm tapped. I am too. And even if I weren't, it's just too late. What are you saying? They're not. They can't be. That's not what I'm saying, Jenna. I... I finally found them. I was going to be with them again, for the first time in years. Jenna... Please, it, it can't be. Mom, wake up! It's me, it's Jenna! Don't leave me. Jenna, you must prepare yourself for what comes next. Being transformed into a dragon, a fighting in that form, this requires tremendous power. What are you saying, Kraden? In fighting you, your parents will fool to use every last ounce of their energy. They don't have the strength to... Even if they had won the battle, they would not have survived. You cannot blame yourself. You monster! 
Why did you do this? Why did you make us fight Jenna's parents? You're no god. You're no protector. You're evil. You don't understand the pain you've caused, wise one. You have no idea the damage done to a child who learns she has destroyed her own parents. That's enough. What? I knew what I was doing the moment I raised my sword. We defied the wise one in order to save the world. Our parents would understand. Don't you think so, Felix? I, I, I don't know if they would. I mean, we, we basically committed a blasphemy. Um... To, to kind of do this and everything. Uh, I agree with my brother. But it is no one any good if we don't complete our task. We'll still have a chance to save Prox. Perhaps we can't save your parents. But we can save countless others. Uh, Kyle and the others saved them too. They sacrificed their lives so that we could go on. I never imagined that my actions would help to save the world. Even though lighting the beacon may create wars and strife, I regret none of this. There's little time left, Felix. Use the Mara Star and light the beacon. Yeah, I know it holds the more, so how do I use it? Why? That's great. Okay, why is it not letting me use the Mars Star? I'm facing the hole. Why? Okay. Um... Oh, do I just talk? Oh, do I just have to talk to everyone? I'm sorry things had to end up like this, Jenna. Look on the hole, maybe? Oh. <laughs> there we go. It's a menu. I have to walk around a little bit and talk to people and everything. Oh, that's cool, actually. The parties are split yet again. That is, that is the cool, the cool symbolism. The parties are now torn apart again. The beacon is lit! And to think, I joined this quest hoping to prevent exactly this from happening. And I began this quest as a prisoner. Taken against my will. 
And if that tidal wave hadn't set me far off course, I wouldn't even be here now. How many lives have been taken and changed forever just to light this beacon? Mom? Dad? The way it is safe now. <sighs> You're right. I hear voices, too. I told you. I told you I could hear them. Who said that? Where are you? We're in email. We're at the base of Mercury Lighthouse. You... you can't be. Oh, the kids. We gave those kids some deep voices. We gave those kids some deep voices. They, they, they hit puberty early. Hey, I know that voice. It's Mia. I just know it. Mia! I'm going with a bit. It's you! Of course it's us. We can hear you, Mia. You're alright. I'm so happy. <laughs> Look, I didn't know about the voices. It didn't give any, like, a little blip 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 at like a different pitch to give me an idea as who's talking. We party you is such a funny name. I mean, we party you, we rock you. They could have made so many punny names for games. For the Wii. And the Wii U. Who are those two kids talking to? I don't know. They've been straddling here, standing here, telling everyone to leave the lighthouse. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to give the the, the, the grown-ups kid kid voices in this scene. In America, you party. In Soviet Russia, we party you. We a couple of kids, if you ask me. Yeah, they got some super deep voices too. How is it that we can hear you? I don't know, but he told us we'd be able to talk to you if we came here now. He? Who's he? I don't know. We were sleeping, and he came to us in a dream. He said, go to the lighthouse. The lighthouse? Why? He said that we have to deliver a message. He was too busy to do it himself. What message? We have to warn everyone to stay clear of the lighthouses. What's going to happen? I don't know, but he told us to warn people away from Mount Aleph as well. But who is he? You still haven't told us. You're a meanie. I don't tell meanies anything. <laughs> don't pay attention to him. It's me, Mia. Can you tell me who spoke to you? I told you. I don't know. But he looked like a big rock, with a big, rocky eye. The... the wise one. What could he be doing? Of course, I understand. The wise one said that when all four lighthouses had been lit, the golden sun will shine. When that happens, now Aleph and the lighthouses will probably become quite dangerous. So the wise one is warning people in dreams, telling them to seek refuge? Why would he do that? You saw what he did to us. He can't be up to anything good. Have you not learned? One's actions do not always reveal one's true intentions. Ha'ama! The sister! Masahama, did you receive a message too? Yes. I was called the Jupiter Lighthouse in a dream. You have completed your quest, but I see it comes with great loss. Your suffering has been almost unbearable. Uh, Master Hama, my parents! I know, Jenna, and I am sorry, but do not give up hope for them just yet. What do you mean, Master Hama? Appearances can be an illusion. The wise one has a caring heart. 
He forced us to fight Isaacs and Jenna's parents. And what's so caring about that? If the wise one were truly evil, he would not be warning me of danger in my dreams. Well, I... I guess not. But then, what's he up to? We do not have time to discuss this right now. She's right. If the wise one said it's not safe to be near the lighthouses, then I think we should listen. I am heading for safety too. All of you must get away from the lighthouse now. Hurry everyone, let's go! What about our parents? We can't leave them behind. I understand how you feel, but we won't make it if we have to take them with us. Make the decision, Felix. Should we take them with us? It's worth a shot. It's too dangerous! The golden sun is forming! Elimination drama? I'm not sure what that is, so... <clears throat> I, I'm, I'm glad I am not part of that drama. <laughs> A ray of light is emanating from the beacon, from the Mars star. And what will happen? The power of alchemy will be unleashed upon the world. We must take Isaac's father and Jenna's parents and flee. Stop it! Let go of my wrist! Garrett, get a grip! No one's touching you! I'm serious, I... The beacon! Jenna, we have to move your parents! Mom! Dad! What's happening? There's no time for questions! Just carry them! Carry them and go! Oh, man. Thank you, Felix. And you too, Isaac and Creighton. By igniting Mars Lighthouse, you stop Gaia Falls from devouring our town. And we're just glad to have helped save Wayard. You've been through many trials, more than any of us can ever know. And Samurai Illumination made a perfect video, I think we made a video critiquer. Oh. Well, that's, that's B from two, hopefully, adults that can maybe act like adults. <laughs> Gosh. Ah, uh, people. Internet drama. This is why I don't get into the politics stuff and everything. We very rarely do. <laughs> I just, I just want to play games, man. I just want to vibe. I just want to grow. And then there's a doxing. Yep. Knew that was gonna happen, apparently. Gosh. Hey, hey. Joke's in you, I already know my address. We had no idea what to expect when we lit the final beacon. When we saw the flash of the beacon, we had no idea what you suffered to light it. I thought we were done for. There was no way we could escape with our parents' bodies. Well, at least not if we hadn't pulled together and overcome our sorrows. Now that light was brilliant. A lot of people in there. Yeah, it's one of those ones where everyone is being horrible to each other. You know, I shall always regret that I didn't get to look upon the beacon's light from afar. I understand your regrets. As a scholar of alchemy, you would have been most impressed. I saw the beams of blue, red, and purple streaming out towards the southeast. Uh, yeah. For the most part. I mean, he was just kind of making response videos. As long as he was respectful, you know, then all good. But I haven't seen any of the videos, so I can't really comment. I saw the beams of blue, red, and purple streaming out towards the southeast. That's the direction in which Vale lies, is it not? Was the light headed to your hometown? 
Indeed it was. The wise one said the beams were going to merge into one above, above Mount Aleph. The orb of golden light we saw. That was shining directly over a veil. Yes, that was the golden sun forming over Mount Aleph. If I remember the sails correctly, the golden sun is the blast of light emitted at the very moment the Stone of Sages forms. Such legends exist even here? I wish I'd known that sooner. I fear for Vale. To think that all this energy is being released right over your hometown. Yeah, unfortunately he's going to get caught up in this too. But that's the nature of getting involved in the drama and everything. We're all worried about that. We're hoping we can return to Vale as quickly as possible. Oh? Is there nothing we can do to convince you to stay? We had hoped you might stay in Prox a while, but that sounds unlikely. And don't worry, we plan on returning as soon as things quiet down, don't we? World Tour! Our village will not soon forget that you saved us from the edge of destruction. Do visit us again. When the time comes, I may no longer be in this world. Don't say such things. I'm sure a long life awaits you. Well, I suppose we should be departing for Vale soon. You're right, Kraden. If we don't, you know who might start causing trouble. At least some of your cares have been remedied. You must be glad to know we've brought all three back from the brink of the- <gasps> Hey! Our parents are alright! I would not have thought it possible had I not seen it. Even I do not fully understand it. There can be no doubt the fire synergy released by the beacon rekindled their spirits. I hadn't expected so much synergy to be released by the lighthouse's beam. I have no real explanation other than that their life forces had not been fully extinguished. It was a miracle, but the fire synergy seems to have recharged them somehow. And had your parents not been adepts, the wave of synergy would have passed them by. Isaac, what's taking you two so long? Don't keep me waiting! Uh-oh, it's Jenna! We're late, and she looks rather displeased with us. Should I let her know we're leaving now? Nah, let's keep her waiting. <laughs> I'm sorry, Jenna. It sounds like things are going to take just a little bit longer. Well, I'm not going to wait much longer. If you don't come soon, we're all leaving without you. I'll wait outside with them. I don't think they want uh, to wait anymore. Oh, we're all set to head home. Oh, I have no patience whatsoever. Ah well, I suppose it's time to leave. And may your journey home be safe and uneventful. We shall never forget what you have done for Prox. Alright, let us head home. You did an amazing job. You accomplished what Agashio and Karas could not. Yeah. Let's go. What took you so long? Mom and Dad are tired of waiting for you. That's not true, Felix. You take as long as you need to say farewell to the people of Prox. Mom! Don't worry about us, Felix. Fuel and the others took good care of us. I don't tell him that. We'll be stuck here forever. You look like you're feeling back to your old self, Jenna. You were weeping such mournful tears after the battle. What? As if? You can't prove anything. <laughs> Aww, she's a tsundere. Go easy on her. You have to remember, she thought that both her parents had died. Oh? Were you crying, Jenna? No, I, I said... I said I wasn't. 
now you got me thinking about my family. I didn't think I'd miss them this much. I only hope that they're all safe back in Vale. I just want to be home again. I want to see how my mother is doing. Don't worry, son. I'm sure Adora is doing fine. She's a strong woman. Uh, but last time I saw her, she looked so sick. So weak. Even if nothing happened to Vale, I'm still worried. Ah, don't worry, Isaac. I'm sure she's in wonderful shape. He in fact could. It was all a quote on Isaac's magical long-range transmission to a different Isaac that doesn't have magical Earth powers. That would be cool if I did. <laughs> I think she'll be surprised to see me. Surprised? She is literally gonna pass out. Like, oh, my, hus my husband's been fought dead for two, th three years or something like that. And now, now, now he's alive. Like, brah. That, that, that's gotta, like, mess with your heart just a little bit. Sorry to keep you all waiting. At last, the time has come for us to return to Vale. As soon as we leave Prox, we're heading toward we're, we'll head toward Angara, and from there to Vale. I can't wait to see this winged ship of yours. It sounds so incredible. I remember so little of our trip to Prox. This is really my first voyage on a ship. I've heard that the wind and waves make the boat rock. I hope I don't get sick. The sanctioned ship of ours actually flies above the ocean. It's quite a cozy ride. It looks like we've got a, an exciting last ship ahead of us, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. Wow. And sitting out like this takes me back to our own quest start. It was so long ago. Yeah, it was. It was, what, four months ago, I think? If you keep talking like this, we'll never go anywhere. Let's go, Felix. What's the matter, boys? Are you reluctant to depart? It's hard to believe that our quest is almost at its end. I know how you feel. I just hope that Vil came out of this in as good as condition as Prox did. Probably a year. Yeah, in-game, probably about a year, but, uh, IRL, about four months since the start of this game with the other boat. We won't know until we get there. I can't stop thinking about how my parents are doing. Oh, we're the both of them and we're the both of them in fail. Can't you make it, guess, Kraden? We'll still be standing when we arrive. Uh, not even I can know that. Eight months since we started the first- Yeah, since we started the first game. But the second game, I think, is four months. Which is like, the journey to the other continent. Yeah, I can see it in your eyes, Kraden. You think something's happened, don't you? It's a possibility. One that cannot be ignored. If it's not there... And then what's the point in even going back? To see if it's there? Only for, for the, like, start, start, the start of the second game. Is that really how you feel, Isaac? What about you, Felix? You remember, don't you, Felix? Think about it for a moment, Isaac. What do you mean? Our conversation with Hama after we ignited the beacon. Don't you remember us talking to the children from Imu at the base of Mercury Lighthouse? When they were warring, when they were warning people away from the lighthouses? Yes, the wise ones instructed everyone to seek refuge. Yeah, so what about it? You still don't see, Garrett? Even if Fair were destroyed, I'd expect that the villagers to have all escaped to safety. I guess that's true. It might still be all right. That's true. So whatever happens, my family's alive. Oh man, my voice is starting to go. I forgot about that. 
Thanks, Creighton. Garrett, can you make sure everyone else knows that? Okay, let's go. The both of you. We have to catch up to everyone. Creighton? Why did the wise one change your parents into a dragon? Why did he make us fight them? I mean, we almost killed them. He tried to make us kill our own parents. Why? Uh, do you think that he intended for them to die from the start? I think he may have known what would have happened. You don't understand why he put you through all this if you knew they'd survive. We cannot hope for, to fathom the motives of a being as all-powerful as the wise one. You don't know either, Creighton. I can only hazard a guess. The wise one wanted to test you. What do you mean, test us? I cannot tell you more, and it is up to you to find the answer. Will we use alchemy to wage war, to raise armies? Or will we use it to grow wise, to rise above our petty feuds and perform great deeds? You are willing to sacrifice everything for your quests. I'd say you've risen to this challenge. Whoops! Is everyone else that far ahead of us? We better hurry and catch up to the others before they leave us behind. After all, I'm not terribly interested in trying to walk all the way back the veil. Vale. If you're the same, then we better be hurrying. Both. We're doing both, old man. Isaac! Felix! We're off! Aw, oh, that was cute. Boom. Boom, ba -doom. Oh my gosh. We have done it. We have beaten both the Golden Suns. Golden Sun and Golden Sun, the Lost Stage. Oh? What's this? Oh, that's Alex. Hi, Alex. The Golden Sun. The very quintessences of alchemy's power. It's beginning. Wait for me, please wait. Wait until I reach the summit of Mount Aleph. Oh, he thought he could do it all by himself. So there's a little like end credit scenes. That's cool. Okay. That's a good way to get people to like sit through your credits and not skip it. That one. it was very fun. Thank you so much for the help, Miss Tina. Oh, there's that one. Got the graphic art. The battle characters. Junku Nakamura, Kari Mats Matsunaga. Battle effects and faces. Junichi Ochiya, Ochiya, Ochiya. Oh gosh. Japanese names. I mean, they did a lot of gray work. Oh my gosh. They did some good stuff. I, I, I'm really happy about this game. This has been a really fun game. Like, they had some moments of frustration, some moments of, where the heck do I do next? Especially the second game. But I kind of love the, 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 the more, you know, focus on the adventurous side of the RPG. That was really cool. Even if the story itself was fairly simplistic. Like, it was really, it was really cool. And really fun. Oh, there's Jupiter. Wait, no, there's, there's yeah, that, that. Have you decided which game is going to replace Golden Sun? I'm thinking uh, the first Mario and Luigi game. I think it's Superstar Saga is the first one. I have to double check. But that that may be the the first the the, the, the game I replace Golden Sun with for RPG Wednesday. Glad you played it. It's it's a really fun game. I'm glad I played it too. Like, like this Chrono Trigger has been really good. I enjoyed Final Fantasy X as well. 
Like, the, the battles of Final Fantasy X were a lot of fun, and the story was pretty cool. Slow start, but like, it got really, really good, kind of around the midway point. It was good stuff. I, I, I quite like Final Fantasy X, actually. Uh, Chrono Trigger is still the favorite I've done. Oh? Ooh? Dude got, uh, annihilated. Alas, I have it! Eternal life and limitless power! Alas, the power of nature is mine to control as I will! Rise, storms! Rise up and unleash your might upon Vale and the foothills of Mount Aleph. A Japanese teacher told us yesterday her favorite game is Final Fantasy X. Nice. Yeah, Final Fantasy X is it is a fun game. Seymour is an absolute punk, though. T -t 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 Tell her you don't want to see more of Seymour. But the rest of the characters are great. That's odd. I should have limitless power. So why can't I call up a simple storm? <laughs> hey, buddy! Who are you? I am called the Wise One. The Wise One. The Wise One! Veil's protector. You wish to have limitless power? I wish to. I just got it. No. Your power is nearly limitless, but it has boundaries. Praising the sun brings bad luck as always. <laughs> Not so fast, bro. Nearly limitless. You speak in riddles. Can't you see? The power is mine. Yes. You also have nearly endless life. And your synergy is... somewhat stronger. I should have a pull? A pull for what? For the, uh, the next game? The next, the next RPG I play? That could be, that could be done as well. I, I might, I might maybe make it uh, either. I still want to do one of the Mario RPGs, but I should see if I want to do Paper Mario or the one of the Mario and Luigi games. I have to see what my options are, and then get back to doing that. Next week probably won't have a Wednesday stream, but I'll be sure to have a lot of other, a lot of other stuff going on to make up for that. If you are trying to anger me. Have a little taste of exactly how much power I've attained. No sticker star? Wait, wait, wait. Sticker star. I heard sticker star is not great. But I still wanna, like, the older, the older Paper Mario's. I wanna see if I can play, like, Thousand Year Door or something like that, or, like, the old, or, like, the original Paper Mario. Oh? Oh? He's trying! Look at me. My body is brimming with power. <laughs> uh, how? What's going on? I should be all powerful. How can you defeat me? You are not all powerful, Alex. Your power has limits. As does your life. That cannot be. Who is responsible for this treachery? Who has robbed me of my dream? I, the wise one, imbue the Mars Tower with some of the power of the forming golden sun. It resets even now in the hands of young Isaac. Oh, it rests even now in the hands of young Isaac. Why? 
There's more after the credits. Don't skip it. I won't. The heavens and the earth are changing, Alex. You must flee now. What? What? Mount Aleph will soon be drawn into the heart of the earth. You must flee or join it forever. Flee? I can't flee. I can't even move. Ah, yes. You now see the limits of your power. If you are swallowed by the earth, you may not survive. That is psycho. Best my RPG is Mario Tennis on the Game Boy. If you survive, perhaps we shall meet again someday. Dang, that is straight cold. He's like, I'm not gonna directly kill you, but I'm not. I'm gonna make sure you can't save yourself either. <laughs> Finally, we reach fail. Hmm. What's the matter, Garrett? You're finally home again. Aren't you happy? Garrett's just worried about what's happened to everyone in Vale. So it's just over that last hill? I can't wait to see what your hometown looks like. That's beautiful. I'm sure you'll like it, Pierce. I'm just gonna close my eyes. Someone tell me if it's alright to open them. Me too. Let someone else see how things are. I'll go. Come with me, Felix. How does it look, Isaac? I'm almost there. It... It can't be. What is it, Isaac? Felix? Say something! Uh, I'm sorry, Jenna. But, Vale... Mount Aleph, they're gone. What? This, this is terrible. Is that Mount Aleph? Mom. Dora. Mom, Dad. Uh, Isaac, get. What can I do? What can I say to comfort you? Oh, man. They're here somewhere. They have to be here. Ah, fun journey's almost over. And it might be bittersweet. What can we do? How can we help them now? I don't know. Call out to them? Such a tragedy. Uh, I'll, I'll call them. Uh, Isaac? Garrett? I understand what you're feeling. I felt it too. But standing here won't bring them back. Now let's go back to Vault. We can rest there and think. Your family's safe, Felix. You don't have anything to worry about anymore. But what am I supposed to do? I'm all alone now. Oh, poor baby. Sheepa? What's gotten into you? How can you say that to Garrett? <laughs> I wonder... What are you talking about? Shiba? Mia? You think this is funny? I've lost everyone. My whole family. Garrett, don't be so sad. I, th I thought you might be a little more confident after all your adventures. Teehee! <laughs> Teehee! Your family just died. Aww. <laughs> Mia Savage! I mean, she can equip the Wicked Maze, so, you know. <laughs> I got to see my brother crying. 
Oh, they're alive! And all their 480p glory. Uh, so you've made it back, Garrett. I knew it would take more than this to beat you, son. Welcome home, Garrett. You look surprised to see us, Garrett. Uh, how did you survive? The wise one warned us of danger. He guided us here to safety. Everything was destroyed. Our homes, our town. But the wise one saved you all? I'm... I'm not alone! If you all made it out, did Dora as well? Mom! Dora. Mom! Welcome home, Kyle. Isaac. You survived! I don't know why his voice is Arthur, but you know what. <laughs> so did you. Ah, oh, that's adorable! Your whole family died a little lots of. <laughs> Oh, that's so cute! Big hug for mom. Ah. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, Mia. Oh, and Felix is actually smiling for once. That's cool. Wow. Can I resume your adventure with this date? Wow. That was fun. Oh my gosh. That was, that was great. That being said though, I am going to be ending the stream here. Because, well, we beat, we beat the game. Thank you all so much for all of your patience and support and everything during this playthrough. Oh my gosh, it was a long time coming, but we finally beat the first and second Golden Sun. I'm super happy about that. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so much fun. Oh my word. <laughs> ah. So that being said, I'm gonna be ending the stream here. Thank you all so much for watching. I do appreciate it. If you enjoyed the stream, please leave a like, subscribe, let me know what I'm doing well in the comments down below. If you didn't like the stream, please let me know what I'm doing poorly so I can fix it in the future. And with that being said, I have an Isaac Umbris. Wherever you're in the world, whatever time of day it is for you, may it be a great time. And I will see you all in the next stream. Y'all have a great night, morning, whatever. Whatever it is. See you all. Bye-bye!